In a world of sports mostly dominated by men, how did a resilient female athlete, who initially faced setbacks, manage to garner a fan base larger than even the greatest competitors in sports history? This is what happened to Paige Spiranak. Born in 1993 in Wheat Ridge, Colorado, Paige Renee Spiranak entered a world of athleticism. Raised in a family with a Croatian background, her father, Dan Spiranak, was a member of the Pittsburgh Panthers football team, while her mother, Annette, graced the stage as a professional ballerina. A perfect blend of genes, Paige inherited the essential elements to become an outstanding athlete. Following in her mother's footsteps, Paige ventured into gymnastics, discovering that her abilities went beyond her parents' genetics. She crafted her unique style, capturing the admiration of judges and coaches alike. Yet Paige's journey wasn't without hurdles. In a sport where aesthetics play a significant role, she faced a rare disease causing her hair to fall out. This unexpected blow shattered her confidence. For the first time, she became a target of bullying, enduring taunts about her appearance. In a discipline where confidence is paramount, Paige struggled to find her footing. Despite the odds, tragedy struck. A gifted athlete winning accolades for high jump and dominating gymnastics, Paige battled not only a rare disease, but also asthma. Fate, however, had other plans. During a routine practice, she landed awkwardly, breaking her kneecap, a one in a million break, warned the doctors. With the Olympics still on the horizon, Paige faced a pivotal moment. She recovered, defying the odds, and dove back into training with unwavering determination. Yet destiny had its own script. In a cruel twist, she broke her kneecap again in the same place. For many, this would signal the end of a dream, a life not worth living. The pursuit that consumed your existence was abruptly over, leaving an irreplaceable void. Paige, too, felt the weight of the setback. She cried, questioned what came next. But deep down, she understood that gymnastics wasn't her entire world. While she enjoyed it, she recognized her potential to succeed in any endeavor she chose to pursue. Paige's story transcends the confines of gymnastics. It's a narrative of resilience, of rising above adversities, and discovering a purpose beyond the confines of a singular passion. Life, Paige realized, held infinite possibilities. She may have faced setbacks, but her spirit remained unbroken. To heal her daughter's wounded spirit, Paige's dad suggested golf when she was just 12 years old. Amidst the challenges Paige faced, the golf course became her refuge, a sanctuary where she could practice, get lost in her own story, and distance herself from the harshness of the world. Starting golf at 12 might seem late in today's world, where many kids begin in single digits. But Paige, with her natural abilities, proved that timing isn't everything. She embraced the sport, practicing diligently every day, competing against the best girls globally, and winning numerous junior competitions. Paige's journey gained momentum, and soon colleges came knocking. Arizona State recognized her talent and offered Paige a golf scholarship. However, something didn't quite click, leading her to transfer to San Diego State, where she felt more at ease. The change reflected in her performance, and in her senior year, the Aztec clinched their first ever Mountain West Conference Championship. With newfound confidence, Paige not only excelled on the course, but also found a sense of belonging, making friends and enjoying college life. In July 2015, she achieved a significant milestone by winning the Colorado Women's Golf Association Match Play Championship. Life was finally good for Paige after a challenging childhood. Yet a twist awaited Paige. A popular college frat website wrote an article about her, attempting to bring her down, but inadvertently turning her into an overnight success. Paige went from 500 to 100,000 Instagram followers. Attention poured in from men across the internet, a stark contrast to her earlier experiences. Amidst the overwhelming response, one person stood out, minor league baseball player Steven Tanaka. They hit it off, began dating, and as Paige's love life blossomed, so did her golf game. Her talent shone on the Cactus Tour, culminating in a victory at the Scottsdale's Orange Tree Country Club in just her third start. Paige's success continued on her first season on tour, including a win and several top 10 and 25 finishes. However, the reality of women's golf prize money was stark, emphasizing the challenges female athletes face. Invitations poured in, not just for her golf prowess, but also for her social media presence and fashion choices. In 2015, she made her European tour debut in Dubai, despite her game not being in top shape. The weekend brought another joy. Her boyfriend proposed, and Paige left the country with a new ring and a heart full of smiles. Back to focusing on golf, Paige aimed for the LPGA Tour. In August 2016, she entered her first LPGA qualifying tournament, but fell short. Criticism ensued, and the comments on social media took a negative turn. 
Invited back to Dubai, Paige faced misery after missing the cut. Her head wasn't in the right space, and everything unraveled in a press conference. Live, she shared her battle with severe cyberbullying and depression, exposing the dark side of the internet. She revealed the shame she faced for her on-course outfits, the death threats, and the unwarranted criticism of her family. In December, Paige made a heartbreaking announcement during a press conference, marking her retirement from professional golf. The dream she pursued tirelessly, the countless hours invested, all stripped away by the harsh comments from people hiding behind screens. Cyberbullying had taken its toll, forcing Paige to step back from social media and the golfing world. The weight of this decision was immense, and Paige needed time to process it all, to figure out the next steps in her career. Amidst the darkness, a glimmer of hope emerged. CyberSmile, a multi-award-winning nonprofit organization, caught wind of Paige's story and reached out. They saw the potential for Paige to become an ambassador, leveraging her following to reach people struggling with similar challenges. Other compassionate companies joined the cause. Deals were inked with PXG for social media and television advertising. Paige became an ambassador for the golf app 18 Birdies and collaborated with clothing brands and watch companies. Her fight for women's rights continued, fueled by her disappointment in the LPGA's increased dress code strictness in 2017, sparking controversy across women's golf. Paige's resilience shone through. She didn't just accept defeat, she turned adversity into an opportunity for change. The following year saw her gain confidence, separating from her husband Steven Tanaka and transforming into a Sports Illustrated swimsuit model. In just two years, Paige evolved from a distraught, bullied girl to a strong, confident, impactful woman. Facing haters head-on, Paige responded with brilliance. She reclaimed her body, her sexuality, and her narrative. A powerful message to those who tried to bring her down. I finally took back what was mine. Surrounded by supportive friends like Michelle Wee and Natalie Gulbis, Paige identified a gap in the market when Gulbis stepped away. She seized the opportunity, diving into various photo shoots. Controversy seemed to fuel her determination, and nothing could shake her resolve. This wasn't just about her, it was a stand for women everywhere. Branching out on all social media platforms, Paige amassed more followers than even the greatest of all time, Tiger Woods. By 2021, she became a shareholder in the global sportsbook operator Sports Bar, assuming roles as an on-air personality and ambassador. The transition from earning a modest $8,000 a year on tour to raking in $11,000 per Instagram post was nothing short of remarkable. Paige's net worth soared to $3 million, an incredible journey from the struggles on the golf course. Controversy may forever surround Paige, but her contributions to the game and women's rights are undeniable. With the empire she's building, there's no necessity for her to return to professional golf. In 2022, she was voted Maxim's Sexiest Woman Alive, showcasing her empowerment and the recognition she receives beyond the fairways. Paige's success and financial status now surpass what she could have achieved on the LPGA Tour. As we navigate through Paige's extraordinary story, we witness the power of resilience, the impact of positive initiatives like CyberSmile, and the transformation of adversity into advocacy. Paige Spiranak has become more than a golfer. She's an emblem of strength, a voice for change, and a reminder that, even in the face of adversity, one can emerge stronger and make a lasting impact. What do you think of Paige and her journey? Sound off in the comments below. And don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for a chance to win a $25 Amazon gift card.